my god guys so i kind of overslept and i have a christmas party to go to so i'm gonna teach you guys a super quick and easy hairstyle that you can do when you're in a rush check this out I've developed a way on how to curl your hair with a flat iron without having to twist it so many times and accidentally burn yourself. Just watch this. I like to just comb my hair a little bit before I start styling it. And I like to use some product, of course. I'm gonna be using Not Your Mother's Clean Freak Refreshing Dry Shampoo at the roots. Just get a little shake and spray it right under like this. Give it a good mix in my hair just to get rid of all the oiliness in the roots. And I comb that all throughout my hair. Then I take a bit of their Whip It Up Cream Styling Mousse. I like to put it in my hand. And it smells like vanilla bean. So I just take it and put it here at the roots. Same with the other side. And then all and I will brush all the product again through my hair. Okay, now that everything is in my hair, I'm going to divide the top half and the bottom half. I take two strands right above my ear and just pull it into a bun. Now that I have my little top bun, I can start by curling the bottom section of my hair. Now here is my method for a hassle-free curling. This style of curling is going to give you really nice lived-in beachy waves, kind of like bedhead hair right when you get up. So if you're in a rush, this is the way to go. I'll start with about a one inch strand. Take my flat iron at the top. I will clamp it, twist, twist one more and slowly pull, giving a final twist at the end. And there you have a little curl. Here's how to do it again. So you clamp at the top, twist your hair over, twist the iron, and pull away from your face slowly, and give it a little twist at the end. I find this so much easier than like twirling the whole iron. So here's one side done and it's time to do the other side. And you can do everything with the same hand even if it's on the opposite side of your head. When it comes to this look, it doesn't have to be perfect. That's why you get that really nice effortless look. So I'm done with the bottom section of my hair. It's time to move to the top. What I like to do is undo my bun, flip my hair forward, and take all the hair I just curled back into a ponytail, and then tie it very loosely so it doesn't leave a kink in your hair. Flip my hair back, and it's so much easier to work with just the hair on top. I like to start from the back and leave the face framing strands last. Clamp, twist, twist, pull. And I'll just throw this piece to the back. And I'm gonna leave this strand here for last. The best way is to curl away from the face. So I take my flat iron, clamp it, and pull it over and twist it away and then pull. So I'm going to undo the back ponytail here. Now I'm just going to run my hands through them. After I'm done curling my hair, I like to spray some of this Beach Babe Soft Wave Sea Salt Spray from Not Your Mother's. So I just spray a bunch onto the bottom. It smells so good, guys. Scrunch it up a scooch. And the best way to get volume right here is to turn your head over Give it a little scrunch and turn into a rock star. And there you go. You can keep this all in place by spraying some She's a Tease Volumizing Hairspray. Just give it a little shake and... This gives it a really nice light hold but also retains the volume in your hair. And here it is.
That was one of the fastest ways I've ever curled my hair with a flat iron, and I didn't burn myself once. This twist twist pull method is perfect. And now I have to get ready for the party. With 30 minutes to spare, see ya. All right, I am just about ready to leave. But before that, I like to make sure everything stays shiny with the Lock Luster Oil Treatment. Pump or two into my hands and just run it through the ends of my hair. And it smells so good, oh my gosh. So here it is guys, I'm ready to go. I'll see you next time. Toodles.